Right, so we now finally got last gem. I know I fucking gonna manage to find it. Let's get up here now we can finally face Ripto. Thank god. Come on. Looking forward to this actually. I enjoy a good fight with Ripto. It's a good boss battle. It's not he can piss off at some points, but mostly it's quite good, I like it. There he is. Oh, doesn't he look cute? He's so small. I'm not trying to patronise him in the slightest. I swear they would have got that shape. Ah, come back here, you useless animals! Hey, Shorty. Maybe I can help. What? You again? <laughs> yep. If you want to test that power crystal, why don't you try it on me? I'll stand still. I promise. Oh, so brave. Hmm. I like that idea. Dragon, you've just sealed your fate! Now, you have to be pretty stupid to believe that he would actually stand there. Ripto, you are a bit cuckoo, I must say. Right, that's where it begins. Spyro, we want to help you fight Ripto. Elora is using the orbs you collected to store power-up energy. Hunter will throw the powered-up orbs to you as they become ready. Even as we speak, the professor is experimenting with new forms of power-up energy, so Ooh. you'll soon have abilities that no one has ever seen before. I like this a lot. Although well, we are relying on Hunter, so that's not the best of things, maybe. We've got his fireballs. We've basically, got to run around and collect the orbs, which Hunter throws down to you. As soon as you get all three, you'll get a certain power-up. It'll be either red, blue, or green. Like that! Bang, bang, bang! Oh no! Vito can do so! Yes, it's good. It's good. Oh no, he's got one! Oh! Ah, oh, that's a good throw. Dang it! Oh, oh, oh! Good one, that's good. Fireballs, fireballs! No, 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 no! Yes! Yes, good. Little orbs. Got one there. Oh, let him get that one. Oh, one there. It's not a major disaster if you don't get any orbs because um, his power ups aren't that much to worry about. Come on, there we go. First round done. He does this. Robo goal. Oh, oh dear. That's clearly not fair. No one said Pokemon were allowed in this match. Otherwise, I'd have put my Pikachu in and it's been easy. Robo goal, go! Come on, Hunter, throw down some walls, bitch! Throw down some moves! Oop. So, yeah, same thing again, just avoid his fire bolts. Come on, there's one there. Oop. Smooth now! The thing about Gob is that he can't move very far, so it's pretty good. Because, like, he just stands there and that's. Oh dear, I'm smooth, aren't I? Oh no! He's got one! Oh dear! Ah! Come on! Yeah! That's pretty good, I think. Oh no! Come on, get a sheep. Might be useful. Oh, you beauty! Ah! Isn't that skillful? Ah, the blue ones aren't that good. Like supercharged, basically. Isn't that good, to be honest? Ah! Get out of it! Ah, oh, dang it! Oh, he's got three. Kind of know what those are. Oh, these things. Oh, that's not too bad, I suppose. Where are they? He's getting them all. Hunter, over here, you stupid cat. Oh, no. No, 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 no. That's good. Well, let's get one here. Come on, let's go and get rid of him. Yes! They're just like, ah oh, no! Damn it, he got a hunter as well. He gets a giant bird. Okay, I'll get my Charizard then. Well, Spyro's sort of Charizard. He just does some leap leap for some reason, the whole thing explodes into billions of pieces. And now it's payback time. So here's the super fly and super flame. He just basically got a destroy this bird. Now, now this, this is the part of the boss battle, like, if you do the skill point, this is where it can get particularly tricky, even when you've got the super flame power at the end of the game. 
Have to be careful like that, see? So he got me there. Dang it. It's not being too tricky though. It's cool, aim some shots and then go into a dive or veer out of it like you're an awesome plane person. Pilot, astronaut, pilot. Come on, we there. My tactic is just to take some shots and veer out of it and hope for the best. Now he starts flying around and. One more hit, I reckon. Come on. Take that, Toad Boy! Oh! Dang, I was going to dive and there'd be a cool line thing, I don't know. Yes! And so ends Riptone. Riptone's reign of terror is over. Woo! Party! Riptone defeated! Oh yes, that's pretty much the game done. Let me have two Dragon Shores and the last couple of skill points. Beautiful. I completely ruined the diamond, though, I think, personally. Oh, it's all nice now. I don't think we can ever thank you enough, Spyro. Oh, Spyro, you're in. I suppose you have to go now? Yeah, I'd better. Dragon in the form me in that the Dragon Worlds, and I've still got a vacation to take. I need it more than ever now. Before you go, I think that Moneybags has something he wants to give you. Hmm, I most certainly do not. Hunter? Ooh. Pwned. I think it's a good word here. Spyro, Moneybags is very sorry that he made you pay so much on your way through it's Avalon. Clearly not. We want you to keep the gems as a reward for helping us. Wow, thanks. Sparks, can you grab them? Let me just type in the new coordinates and... There! Spyro, you can now go to Dragon Shores. Hey, why don't you guys come with me? I bet you could use a holiday. I'm afraid we can't, Spyro. Ripto may be gone, but he caused a lot of damage during his short stay. We'll be cleaning up for weeks. Just remember, though, that you can always get back to Avalar from Dragon Shores if you want to visit. Well, okay. Come on, Sparks. We've got a lot of vacation to catch up on. Oh, yeah. Good old Spyro. I think he deserves it, I always. Top effort, I think, personally, from him. And here are the lovely credits, the awesome credit music. This basically gives you a nice little tour of Avalar, of most of the levels. And that's it then. That's pretty much most of what we've done apart from the last couple of little tweaks that we've got to do. Hope you've enjoyed it. I certainly have. It's been a good game. It's a brilliant game to LP. I'd definitely recommend it for anyone who's thinking about starting LPing. Brilliant game choice. I mean, Spider Games is amazing. I mean, the, the new ones, no way. Legend of Spyro games, whatever. I'm quite sort of glad they cancelled the movie on um, Legend of Spyro, if I'm actually honest, because I wouldn't want them to make a movie unless it was on um, this, to be honest. But that's it then, that's all I can talk about. I think I might say some more stuff like in another part. I hope you all enjoyed it. I'm most going to sit back and watch the credits and let you enjoy the cool music and the look at all the people who put a top effort into making this an awesome game. See ya. Now I'm back again. Yeah, I just thought I'd clear up because some of you have been wondering, like, oh, why didn't I do 
Spyro 1 first. Of course, Spyro 1's my favourite game out of all the Spyro games, and also one of my favourite PS1 games, and also probably one of my favourite games of all time. So I sort of wanted to like, do it last, in fact, to give it a sort of send off. I, I will get around to doing Spyro, um, Spyro 2. But I know you want to see me do it. But it's not, sorry, Spyro 3, because it is an awesome game. So I'll do that as well at some point, but probably not anytime soon. I've got other games I'm gonna do, which will be surprises for you to guess and that sort of thing. That's pretty much it. See you in the next part at Dragon Shores. It's gonna be good.